Hello, good morning. This is Jack. I have an update here. This is Neo Spin 12, the flux thruster autumn pulser Rodan coil, but it's called the Rodan Sandwich Island Motor. I've got a new setup here. I've built another box. It has real bearings and it's uh, pretty cool. So here's the motor. Here's the sandwich with the two Rodan coils and a little 555 timer circuit, the 3055 power transistor. This little 12 volt battery on the side that I can charge up and use that sometimes too. And then I'll give you a quick look at the sandwich here. Here we go. Take this off. So there you go. It's running real quiet and it's going pretty fast. And there's my stainless steel bearings, which are, well, they do have some magnetic influence but not a lot to keep them away from there. The, um, there's uh, Buzz Aldrin and Neil Armstrong uh, looking on and over here we have um, the charge on these two capacitors down here charging up a thousand microfarads and up to 104 volts. That started out, oh it took about five minutes I guess maybe less, to go to 104 volts. It seems to be slowing down a little. But if you speed up the motor with the pot, um, that's the 100K pot to the 555, we can get some more RPMs going here. Well, a little bit too much. It tends to go into oscillation. I still have my stainless um, bearing rods back ordered. And for people who want to build this thing, here we go. Here's a diagram for you with as pretty much information as I thought might be useful. And then I'll zoom in and hold it steady as much as I can. And uh, there you go. Let's go back and take a little quick shot at this guy. And a little um, testament for um, the guys, the designers. Mr. Tesla wrote and Bedini know how doth the radiant energy flow? Um, precisely into our world just so to help our compassion grow and there is a final shot of the Bedini excuse me the Rodan Sandwich Island motor thanks very much